what's up, guys? So consider joining our locals. If you like the fact that we catch predators nationwide, it's not possible without you joining our locals. On locals, you get to see over 20 catches early, completely uncensored. You get to see live predator confrontations as they happen. And you get to support the movement that has an arrest in 43 different states and convictions in 24. We do travel the most and catch the sickest. It's only $7 a month. You get more early content than Rumble. We do big content dumps every single month on locals. And can't do this without you guys. Consider joining locals. How's it going? Is there a pole that lives here? Yeah. Uh, I got a package. Okay. How I'm good, how are you? Good. How's it going, Paul? Nice to meet you. Yeah. My name is Gordon. Yeah. Got some messages to Emily I need to talk to you about. Hello? Emily. Emily? Hmm? Oh. Yeah. I, I just blocked her on Facebook. Okay. So, all right. Well, I told her I didn't want nothing to do with her no more. Okay. Well, would you? Hey, I just want to talk about her, homie. That's all. Okay. Here, all right. Cool. I got I got people with me for uh, safety reasons because obviously we're rolling up on a tra trailer and shit. Um, they're, they're about to come with me right now, but we're, we're, you're not packing anything in your pockets. No, Deadly weapon. Um, you got the same shorts I have though. And, and we even we even brought cameras so you can be sure we're not coming on your property to hurt you, take anything from you, or anything like that. That's why the yeah. cameras are there. Um, just so it's all yeah. recorded. I mean, we didn't do that. She wanted me to come over and sleep with her and stuff like that, and I'm like, you're 11 years old, I can't sleep with you. Okay, okay. So, I, I don't want her mom to get mad at me or nothing. Sure, sure, sure. She's like, I told her I, was, I wasn't coming in there if I had a flat tire, but I got my excuse not going in there. And then she's unblocking me. So fine, go ahead, block me. Okay, okay. Heard my killer cat. I know, golly. Mm -hmm. Man. It's okay, baby, go on inside. Huh? You go ahead inside. You got your pants finally? I don't know yet. I got my overalls. Okay. All right. She said I had a package. I'm like, what? <laughs> I guess she had the package. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So, obviously, like you said, Emily was... This is, I can't see anything with this is the I Facebook can't. messages here. Okay. Uh, we can kind of, uh, I can stand right here or I can, stand you know, right yeah. Side. That's why I was going to go down there and say. Oh, yeah, we can just do that. Yeah, that's fine. Well, you know, obviously it's voluntary to talk to us, but I think we probably should just clear everything up. You know yeah. what I mean? Yeah. I, I told her I wasn't coming in because I, I don't want to get in trouble. Okay, okay. I, yeah, so she sent me a friend's request. I looked later at once and then she sent it back to me mm -hmm. and stuff like that. And I was, started, I was trying to be a nice guy, but she said she wanted friends mm -hmm. and stuff like that. And she said she wanted me to take her from her. And I found out she was 11 years old and I'm like, oh shit. Well, I think she said that at the beginning though. Yeah. Okay. That's the second time, yeah. Okay. So I just. I, well, I, I, I got my old lady here and stuff. So, yeah. Okay, you, I'm not here. So. That damn nosy asses. I oh, know. Go ahead. I'm talking to these guys. How's it going? Right. Good. So, go ahead. Everything's okay. Right. Got your house like a car full of Mexicans. <laughs> <What>? <laughs> no. He no. probably thought there was a bunch of car full of Mexicans. He said. <laughs> he said. Well, she said she said she was 11 at the beginning. You know. Yeah. Okay. So yeah. what kind of happened I was after just that? Talking to her and stuff. Sure. That's going on. Okay. Okay. So. That's my work on a race car. Oh, you, is that what you do for work? Yeah. What do you do? Oh, I work at a welding shop. Okay. But you know how to work at race cars and shit. Yeah. Well, dude, you do. That's fucking cool. Yeah. You, you like know, go to. You go know to Brady Short there in Mitchell? Mm hmm. That's his car. And you worked on that? Yeah. That's fucking I've amazing. I've been doing it for 25 years. Wow. On Friday nights, but we didn't race in this. He's in, he's in Florida right now. Okay. You know that trailer place in Mitchell? No. There's a trailer place there but where Briscoe's mobile homes used to be. Mm hmm. He, all them trailers you pull behind your car and stuff mm -hmm. like that, and you haul stuff on. He owns that stuff. Oh shit! Yeah. So you're part of his crew. Yeah. Nice. That's amazing, dude. Cool as shit. Okay. So, um, I guess you guys are both in Bedford area. Yeah, I'm from right here. Okay. I, I was born in Solomon, Indiana, but I moved to Bedford. And mm -hmm. I, then my kids, we all went down to Kentucky, 
and we moved back up here. Okay. And stuff like that. And I moved up. Me and my ex split up, and it was all her family down there. And you know how hillbilly Jack. Right, right, right. I like, up. Oh, I'm going back to Indiana. I walked all the way back from that down there. Damn, you walked. The he walked to Indiana. Yeah. And he still got a beer belly. He didn't lose any of the uh, weight. It's, oh well, it's, I, it's, I, I need to walk to Indiana belly. too. It's a lot of food. It's a lot of food. Yeah. yeah. I'm, I'm trying to drink, quit drink coke. You see my water on the car. I'm trying to quit drink coke. Absolutely, absolutely. Yeah. Um, so where does Emily live? She said behind the, those apartments, behind the, over by the Legion. Yeah, so, yeah, yeah. Okay. So I think I think at pretty early Emily was asked like you asked her to kind of hang out or something. Yeah. I okay. Wanted, she, I asked her she wanted to go to racetrack with, with me and her and stuff like that. Okay. I, I didn't want to take her without having somebody being around me. Okay. And so I think my son goes with me all the time too. To the racetrack. He's, yeah, he's 17. He works on a race car too. Oh, nice. Okay. Do you have a cool, cool little family going on here? Yeah. Nice. Okay. So I mean, when I'm in the process of getting my daughter back too. And really? I don't want to get no trouble for none of this. Shit. Yeah, I don't, I don't want this to get in the way of anything. Yeah, I know. I've seen you guys probably around. Is that or junk in it? What? That's because of cameras and stuff. I didn't know. Cause I, I, I didn't think, miss with anybody younger. I think there's a group that does something like that around Indiana, but it, that's not us. Yeah, she just blocked me a while ago on there because I told her I wasn't coming. Okay. Okay. So, I'm like, fine. See you. Yeah, no. If it, if it, got, there's guys on there on her Facebook tells her they love her and so right. they're about 60, 70 years old. Right, right. And you I know, they say, hey, she's 11 years old. People, I'm, I joke around with her and stuff like that, but I ain't gonna go have with her. Right, like, and the, you know, like those people are like the true, real bad ones. That's what I'm just talking to you. You know what I mean? So, mm -hmm. um, so when she was asked to hang out, um, you said, would you like to play? She said, yeah. What we play? You said cuddle. And you asked, have you been with a guy yet? She said, no. And she said, so I'd be your first. And she said, well, yeah, we're at anywhere you want. I was joking around with all about that shit. Okay. And you asked, you want me to pick you up? Can we make love? Is everything going, is everything okay, like, with you and your wife right yeah, now? Yeah, I just got some stress going on right now. Okay. So that's what, wise, that's what it is? Yeah. Okay. So you kind of, this was an escape in a way? Yeah. Okay. It's so. Like, want someone to hang out with. Okay. Me and her, get, we get along just fine. But we it's just. Sex every damn night. Okay. But <laughs> it's more like your life, life's kind of beating you down a little bit. Okay. That's why I got so much gray hair, and I'm only 52. Right, right. <laughs> now, you can't tell I got gray hair no more because I shaved it all off. Mm -hmm. I've been trying to get them damn things going. Okay. Well, I kind of more understand this now. Like, I know you're not a bad dude or yeah. anything. Okay. She's all, oh, what do you mean if you said sex if you want? Okay. So you weren't forcing here to force anything. Okay. And she said, is that okay? I would love that. And you said. She didn't send me pictures of her and her panties and stuff while, while I go. She did? Yeah. Okay. I deleted it off my phone. Okay. Was she ever asked? Just said, like, or anything? No, I asked, I asked if I could see her and stuff like that. And she said, okay. selfies? And I'm like, yeah. And she didn't picture her face and stuff like that. Okay, and Paul. I said, you're cute. Are, are you sure you didn't ask to see like her boobs or anything? I asked her a couple of times. Okay, okay. So, Got it. So, but, what were you planning on doing with those pics? I deleted them. I no, no, like... I was going to look at them and delete them. If she, if she sent you like a pic, like what would you have done with it? I just looked at it and deleted it. Okay, that's fair. So, you said when we have sex, I can go down with I never would seen her or nothing like that. You didn't try to go see her? No. no. She wanted me to come tonight. Okay. But I'm like, nah. Okay. Did you send... I, I used an excuse saying I had a flat tire. Right, right. Did, did you send your... Uh, that's not your mind, though. Well, it's just, it's the same. Um, I know, but it's not, not a picture of my... I can tell you that right now. Mine's too damn little. <laughs> okay. But this was like two... <laughs> it was like two of the same bulge, kind of in different pictures. Yeah. That's not mine. I could, I could prove that. <laughs> okay. I had so much stress and... Uh, uh, diabetes and stuff like that and, uh, mm -hmm. and stuff. When I get a chance to have sex with her every night, I, I take advantage of it okay. and stuff like that. So how is, how is life kind of stressing you out? Money-wise. Okay. So I'm more kind of understand why this is going on now, okay? Because I, 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 I told her I wasn't going. I told her, I said, I got a flat tire, so that's my excuse not going. Mm -hmm. and stuff. So I think if, uh, you, if you had money, you probably wouldn't be doing this? No. Okay, okay. So... I'm, I work my ass off, and I ain't got nothing to show for it. Really? I'm behind on my rent, and my landlord lives right there. How much is rent? 500 a month. How are you behind on it? I got car payments and stuff like that, and I travel all over the all United States. Oh, you, tra you travel all over? Nice. I, racing. They don't, they don't pay you well for that? No. What? They, I just do it for free. Oh, okay. You just like the experience. Yeah. Well, I mean, life's, I mean it's this life, it's, man. It's $110 to get in each night for me my go, because me, her, and my son. Okay. And, that, and I... He may go in and have fun with the race car. So do, they least, do they at least let you in for free? No. No? I got to pay my way in. Oh, they used to pay my way in. Uh -huh. And plus, pay, gave me money. Wow. My son's getting my eyes again. <laughs> yeah. I got I got welding burns on my eyes. Okay. I work okay. welding shop. Got it. That's why I try to stay out of the sun so much. Mm -hmm. Mm hmm So you're, you're like, you're not gay, but you're a f***er in a way. I don't know what that means. Well, kind of with welding and stuff like that? Yeah. Okay. So, um... 
She said, show me your sweet um, She never did. Okay. So did you mean like a picture there or like an actual in person? Picture. A yeah. picture? Okay. Yeah. I don't, I don't want to meet her in person. Okay. So you asked her, what is your address? And she, she gave me that tonight, and that's what she wanted me okay. to come over in, in Bedford to see her. Well, this is her asking, like, in June, right here? Yeah. Okay. So why why Saturday morning? Like, I think the first time was Saturday morning, then you asked again Saturday morning. That's just when I'm, I'm always free. So, okay, got it. Makes so sense. Like and then evenings, I, I don't want to do anything, even when I get home from work. Mm -hmm. okay. Got it. So, um, you know, then you asked her to have with you three times a night, which I, I, I asked her how many times she can handle it. Okay, how okay, okay, so, okay. You were just asking her that. She, she said, Many times you want to do it. Okay, so like you're 11 said, years old and you, and you, you know, got all these other guys asking her to meet them and stuff like that, too. right? Right, and stuff like that. And I'm the only one that's close enough to her, and sure. That's what she wanted to meet, okay. And she wanted me, her mom's won't be home till tomorrow morning sometime. She wanted me to come stay all night with her, okay. Tonight. And I thought, No, nah, I can't do that, okay. So, mm. sometime in June, I think you did go to her apartments. I went past there. Okay. And so there's those apartments by the Legion. Because my work's right down the road from it. Okay. And stuff. All right. But you took... You know, you know where um, NFAB is? NFAB? Yeah. Mm -hmm. All them welding shops. Mm -hmm. We bought the um, Manchester tank building. And it's right there. Because right, I go over to the license branch a lot. And plus, I'm over at DCS talking to them about my kid. Okay. My, my young son. Got it. So, I mean, <laughs> you, you took a picture at, um, I think, like 7 o'clock in the morning or something like that. Yeah, I was outside. I was out, went by, by there and I was talking to some guy there I knew and stuff like that. I, oh, at the apartments? Yeah. Okay. I, my, my, my best friend used to live in those apartments. Really? He's in a wheelchair. I used to take him to races with me a lot too when he was younger. Okay. I, I teach him how to bowl. Okay. Like, there ain't no bowling alley no more. That's what's wrong. There ain't nothing, nothing to do in this town. Right. Yeah. It's becoming kind of desolate. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, you take a I picture. Drink water real quick. Sure. Uh, my mouth died. Coming back? Yeah, right here. All right. Oh, my mouth's getting dry talking. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, no, absolutely. I'm trying, you see, I'm trying to drink, quit drinking Coke. Right. You see, I got pop cans over there. Mm -hmm. So you say you want to come to my house Saturday morning, we can do it, blah, 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 blah. I'm trying to do that when I got brothers living here with me. Oh, right. <laughs> so well, you pay ready at Saturday morning. Then you say, what time will she be off Saturday morning? We can do it in your bed or mine or in my car, blah, 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 blah. Okay. So. I'm just joking around with it because I can't, I can't do that shit. Mm -hmm. My old lady, I, we all work together. Right. So this is her, this is you at the apartments at um, yeah, at 7.03 a.m. And. Um, that's about the time I sent the picture, but I took the picture before then. Okay. So you were there like at six something? I don't know what time it was. Okay. I drove by there and then one of the guys I used to bowl with was living there. He walked past and I drove him out the end of the thing. Mm -hmm. And then at 7.21, you try to call her and say you up. And then at 9, 9, 9 a.m., two hours later, you say you're waiting. I was at work. Okay. But June 17th was a Saturday. Yeah, I work sometimes on Saturdays. Okay. But, see, I work, I will go in when I want to, stuff like that. Yeah. Hey, Paul, it's it's okay. We we were kind of looking at your car the whole time you were there. All right. You don't, look, there's nobody around. I, I don't want to talk to you here, but I'm glad they're not around. It's it's okay. We're we're not mad at you, bro. It, we're okay. I I use the excuse of my having a flat tire, and not going over there. I know, but that was because they're all home right now. No, I, even though they went home, I wouldn't have been over there. Okay, but but you were waiting for two hours a few weeks ago for her. Not, not at her apartment. Though. I was at the work at my old lady's work. This is her apartments right yeah, here. I, I went in front of her apartment. I was taking the picture and stuff like that. Okay. Then, I, then, then I 20 left. minutes later, you called her. I was. Yeah, so. Paul, we were watching it the whole time. Was you? Mm -hmm. I was there for, I don't know how long I was there. It was, it was over an hour, easily. So sitting out there for an hour? Yeah. So I know I went to Walmart and then I went back to over to work. Mm -hmm. But you were, you were waiting for her to wake up and we saw you take out your phone, try to call her. We saw the look on your face when she wasn't picking up. We, we, we saw all that, okay? Like, I'm not, I'm not like, yeah. I'm not, I'm not, since you, you know, that's why I'm talking to you. You told me there was like stress going on yeah. and stuff like that. It's not because you're a creep. You're not. I, I know you're not a creep. I've okay? never been with anybody that young. Right. So right. Like, so. She asked me if I ever been with someone that young. I told her no. Okay. And here you say, and this was this was like the day or two before um, you you went over there. You say, are you ready to lose your? See, so yeah, I want. You say, well, show me the. I want to be the first in you. I go slow in you. Give me your address. Yeah. I deleted okay. everything off there. Okay, that's so. fine. So. So she, she sent me a note, I deleted her before, and then she sent me a friend's request again. She okay. She was crying because 
We didn't get to talk and stuff. So. Right. So it was kind of both both people at this. It wasn't just you kind of forcing yourself, anything yeah. like that. Okay. Yeah. So my, my, my question is, you know, obviously, you know, obviously the messages are the messages and, you know, you say, lose your, lose your, you blocked me. I said, thank goodness. Yeah. Lose your, lose your, all that. But yeah. like when you were there on this 17th, my, I mean, I'm not going to debate whether, what you wanted to do because it, it's all in the messages, yeah. but were you planning on like forcing yourself onto no. her? Okay. Were you, I mean, cause you said, I for, for say yes. okay. So, so you said I, in one I of the, okay. So you, so you said in one of the messages, I want to have sex, but it's up to you. Yeah. Okay. So were you planning on doing it? If, if like, we were leaving it up to her to do that stuff? Yeah. Okay. That's that time I was talking to her about it and stuff like that. Then I, then I quit talking to her about it. Okay. So, so basically when you were there to meet on the 17th, um, I'm kind of glad she didn't wake up. Okay. Like that. Okay. But, but you would have had, sex, but only if she's okay with it, you yeah. wouldn't. Okay. Okay. Like then she said, I ain't gonna tell my mom or nothing like that. Okay, got it. So, so you wouldn't have or anything like no. that? Okay. So basically... I you on that on my heart. Okay. So, so basically, to put it frank, your would have only went in her that day only if she gives you her permission for that? I, I won't do anything unless somebody says yes. Okay. So only if she said yes, that's how you would have done it. Is that right? Probably. Okay. Okay. I, I, got it. So, so... And all the... I like that mask he's got. Yeah. It's, <laughs> he saw the Confederate flag and he's like, I gotta fit in with you guys. But uh, we got that on eBay, I think it was. Okay. So like that mole you did. I mean, I'm right wing as shit, but isn't the Confederate flag like the I receive disability flag for most people? I, I don't know. A lot of people take some racist. And, I don't, I think, don't it's think it's racist. It's, it's, it's a flag. People, I know a bunch of pack people likes it. Absolutely. What's it? What? From the southern states, but still. If you really think about it, the Democrats are the real racists. Yeah, what they did. I just want to get them out of our country. Yeah. I mean, you see what they're doing to Clarence Thomas, who like he's a black Supreme Court justice, who's yeah. like, yeah. I went to my best friend's funeral. I used to bowl with Johnny Bashir. His funeral was Monday. And he's black, and I got more respect for him than I do anybody. Absolutely. And stuff like that, because he, he drilled a lot of my bowling balls when I used to bowl all the time. Because I went, went to pro once. You were, you were a pro bowler? I, I, I beat a bunch of pros before. Really? I averaged 245 if I quit. I did that for five years in a row. And I, I just got bored. All right. In the bowling alley now, it tore down. So you're hoping like you get spared tonight, or for a spare tonight maybe, or? Oh, bowling, bowling. Bowling? Yeah. I just held my hand and just made it through strikes. Okay. I never really did too many spares. Okay. I'm the only one in Bedford that I had back-to-back 300s. Yeah, back to the, so you rolled 300 in bowling. Yeah, I got, right there's Mr. 300. I set 79 of them. God damn. 79, 300. I, I mean, and you were even built like a bowling ball, too? I think you're just all about no, bowling. I used to be skinnier in this. I did, too. I did, too. My, my stepdad, when I was younger, uh -huh. he used to work at Thompson's Dairy. Yeah. He used to bring ice cream home every day, and that's when he rolled. <laughs> Shit, okay. Then that coke the up big time. Yep, yep. So. Okay, so kind of back to Emily. So, so okay, so that gives me a piece I'm of mind. Her, yeah. Okay, but it's just kind of, you know, because obviously we want your daughter back, right? Yeah. So we don't, you know, obviously if, if they saw something like this. Right, right, right. I got you. But if they, if they. She's living with smoking dope with her. And stuff okay. Like I'm trying to find DCS if they get, they get help me do, and they gave me some lawyer to talk to and a bunch of other junk. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to get custody of that. So, so all this stuff about like, you know, sitting on your nose looking you would have only done that if she gives like full permission for it. That's, I was joking around about that part. So it would have only been sex then, or? I just, I just wanted to go out and have fun, hang out with somebody. Man. Okay, I'll have fun. I mean, yeah, you, you, you mentioned like you mentioned like the whole you mentioned stress going yeah. on. Okay, I'm, I'm stressed out like crazy. I, okay, we're, we're so slow at work right now. Okay, and I'm stressed. I'm going to get laid off. My son got laid off yesterday. Okay, so, so is that kind of why this has happened then? Yeah. Okay. Okay, got it. So you, you just needed some stress relief there or something? I was, I, she gives me plenty of stress relief. I just want to have someone to talk to mainly. But okay. I really, probably would never had sex with her, but I would want someone to talk to. Okay. I, joke, I, I joke around with people. Okay, but but Paul, when I know I, I when, know I when you're waiting there, I want to look your sweet I have you in my arms kisses. Let me see your beautiful face. Like, I'm, I'm not here to d debate you whether yeah. you wanted to do it or not, because, yeah. I mean, obviously you, you did. Because I, now, now that I know the reason for it is the stress, okay? Yeah. I, I don't I'm, know if I'm gonna get in trouble for all this stuff. Well, I mean, you know, we're we're just here talking to you, but um, I'm looking for a while until you until you tell me to put it in slow. Like, I'm not gonna debate you on whether yeah. that was gonna happen or not. I'm I'm debating you on whether you were gonna force it on her or whether I she was okay. Even at nighttime and she's not feeling good, I won't I won't touch her. Okay, so it was gonna be the same she with. She said she's sick and stuff like that. So, all right. We'll okay. See. So so it was gonna be the same with Emily. Like this stuff would only happen if she gives you full permission for it. That's the only way I do anything with anybody. They say yes. Okay. Okay, so was Emily an exception to that? Like, would you have forced yourself on Emily? Or no, okay, never done that. okay. So was your plan then just going over like? You got the oh. pictures of her. She sent me tonight on there. Mm -hmm. Or her sent me yep. her panties yep. and stuff. Okay, so so was your plan on Emily only doing this if she gives full 
consent and permission well, she was for 18. it. Yeah. Been like, eat better on me. I, I know. I would have went and met her if she was 18. Well, you already did go to meet her. I, I went over there, but I didn't stay. You I stayed for I, over an hour. We, I we saw. an hour. I don't, I, I'm okay. a, I don't know what time it was. <laughs> this is pretty long. You stayed I out, out there, then, okay. then I went out there and sat, talked to that guy. Okay. And stuff like that. It was when I was walking out there. Okay. And I to him. Got it. So. So, this, so, so that's the thing, like, yeah, I mean, obviously this isn't, doesn't make you look like an angel, but here you even say, I want that this weekend on my face. I mean, no, no, like, none part. of this is a joke. I mean, this isn't like a... I know, I know you're taking it serious. Well, I'm not, it's not about taking it serious, it's just you weren't joking when you said this. I mean, yeah. none of this, there's no LOL here, there's not, there's not anything. You said set it for 6 a.m., you have an amazing day. Like, Paul, I'm not concerned about whether you want to do this or not, because obviously you did, that's why I'm here talking to you. It, it's about, it's about... Would you have done this only if she gives permission? Maybe. Okay. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna lie about it. I, was, I, I do need a stress release and stuff like that. But okay. I, I probably would never really done anything with her. I probably wouldn't talk to her, that'd be it. Paul. But like tonight. I'll, I'm not talking about tonight. I'm talking about the last few weeks. I'm talking about when you, when you showed up there. I know I showed up there that one morning. Okay. I thought she wanted to go out and hang out and stuff. She wanted to go do something. Paul. I was gonna take her to breakfast that morning. Paul. I know I was. You, you were talking about going into her bed and doing stuff with her, okay? You said, are we gonna do it in my, in my car or in your bedroom? And she said she wanted to do it in the car. Okay. And stuff like that. Okay. So, so that, that's, that's my thing. I mean, you said in the beginning, I'm leaving it up to you. I mean, all this stuff, were you, gonna, were you fully gonna just leave it up to her to do? Yeah. Okay. Because I'm not gonna force myself on her. Okay. And stuff like that. She's a cute little girl and stuff like that. That's, okay. That's why I told her she's beautiful. Okay. So, so you think she's cute. You just need some stress relief. So that's why this happens. Because I'm, I'm just trying to get figure out why it happened. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So. Okay. So, so the only situation where you would actually do the stuff in here is if she like she has to tell you it's okay. Is what you're yeah. saying? Okay. I, I won't force myself on. Okay. Nobody. So what if you're in person with her and she says I don't want to do this? I'll leave. Okay. So you, you would have only done said stuff if she's wanting to or stuff like that? Okay, I appreciate that. Appreciate your honesty. Yeah. Okay. So, so how many times did, um, what were you planning on this being? Like, truly, like you said, I hope your mom doesn't find out, blah, 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 blah. Like, like, she, she told me she not to tell her mom what she told me to today. So I said, I won't tell nobody if you don't tell anybody. Okay. So like that, and I, was, I told her I was on my way to town, but I was in there sitting down there sitting on the couch. And stuff like that. And I took, sent a picture of her. I was sitting in my car. I was out here working on my lawnmower. About to get out of the car, took a picture. I was sweating like a foreign church. But mm -hmm. as you, you know, I was sweating out here too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, absolutely. <laughs> but Paul, I, I know there's a thing that um, yeah. they're not supposed to send, yeah. and you kept asking for for like for that. right. You were asking for so you can go over there. Okay. Like Paul, Paul, Paul. You you don't have to. Like none of us here are judging you. None of us here are judging you about anything, okay? Like, tattoo, yeah, it's sick. So I got this one right here. Oh, shit, let me see. oh, is that for 9 11? Yeah. Wow. Not finished, though, though. The guy's oh, doing those. it. Plus, 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 more stuff there. Plus, be windows in it. And that, uh, Big Daddy that owns Big Daddy's tattoos. He said he's going to redo it for me because his other guy did. We, my ex wife used to babysit their kids, uh, and he did it for free. Oh, damn. damn, okay. The other one, you know, there was Craven College. There used to be a tattoo up on the square. Mm -hmm. He did the top two things, and and Big Daddy did that right there. That's my daughter's name, my oldest one. She's 20. Okay. And stuff. And then that right there, Kevin College, I think, did that. And this right here is a free one. That's Brady Short, his race car number. <laughs> I had that done a long time ago. Nice. Some more of them. I want to get my other two kids' names on me. Nice. My son, he's, his name's Zachary, but I'm going to put Zach. That's all we call him, Zach. <laughs> like the last one. He got laid off yesterday from work. Damn, okay. And so now I'm trying to figure out how we're going to do it because we were all splitting bills up between all three of us. And now this is me and her. And it's going to be hard. Got it. My bill's been killing me. What, what does she do for work? She works at Soap Shop. Okay. Shop. Okay. And stuff like that. He used to work in the finish room, but he, they only make $10 an hour and that's not worth it. Sure. Yeah. I mean, the minimum wage I was always went up. How much do you make an hour? I make 17 That's not bad. Not for Bedford, but still it's not hard to survive when you got $100 car payment every week. Every week? Yeah. Damn. Superiors, if tells you anything. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> that place is. If you miss, if you're not there Friday, pay it. They're they're coming and knocking on your door Saturday morning. Jeez. If not, they put a club on your car until you come pay it. That's ridiculous. That's yeah, that's crazy. So we're trying, we're trying to clean this place up. How many acres do you have? This that fence right there. This is a weird property from that fence right there, that pole to the 
couple of trees up that way. Okay. It's a dying. We were trying to clean that off right there, but guys said, no, don't clean out. It's for deer hunting and stuff like that. You ain't shooting no damn deers right here towards my trailer. Right, 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 right. So, so, there's all kinds of deer running around out there. Okay. So, so, so you were asking Emily for tonight, weren't you? Like, sh show, me show me in the shower. Show me in the shower. Okay. Yeah. All right. Got it. So, so, yeah. so I mean, I, I, I asked her, but she didn't send it. Uh, right. Fine. Right. Right. So I'll show you in person what she told me. Okay. So obviously, you know, and I feel like I can talk to you about this because you're not like the people on her page. Yeah. So, you know, obviously, you know, the is to verify that they're real so you can go over there and whatever. Like, I mean, I know how this works. Yeah. If okay. I'm going to prove that there's a real person. So. Okay. She, she called me and talked to me. Okay. And stuff like that. Was that not enough proof? Did you need the for proof still? I just, I just wanted something to see, to look at. Okay. I'll admit to that. I wanted something to look at. Okay. So, okay. But she didn't do it. And I said, fine. Okay. So that was also kind of an escape or something? Uh, I just like looking at pictures. Okay. Would you have gone if she sent the. No. Okay. I, I know that I wouldn't. Because I wasn't going to go. <laughs> I, I told her I was coming. I thought. Okay. I've been sitting here in the driveway the whole time. I so, with her. so what's going on at 7 a.m.? So you say, are you alone at 7 a.m. on Saturdays? I am sometimes. Okay. So when you went over there that Saturday, you were alone? I was. We were going to go eat breakfast. I was told I'd take her to breakfast and stuff like that, and then we'd do whatever she wanted to do. Okay. So you were leaving this stuff up to her that Saturday? Yeah. Okay. So you would have only participated in said stuff that y'all talked about only if she wanted to do it? Yeah. Okay. Well, I, I respect that. Okay. So, Paul, I, I got to ask, like, did y'all talk on Telegram at all or anything like that? Just only on Facebook. Only on Facebook? Yeah. Okay. Do you have Telegram? No. No. Did you ever have Telegram? I had Google and uh, um, whatever that name. Like you send you either straight Google Talk and then uh, what's up? But she's never sent me anything on those. But the only time we ever talk is on Facebook. Okay. So, okay. Got it. So I, I gotta ask. Like all kinds of older women sends me pictures all the damn time. Yeah. I can look at it and I delete them. Okay. The only thing they ask for is getting stem cards. Uh, getting sim cards? Stems. Stems? What's that? It's a card. It's like Amazon cards and stuff like that. They get money on. Oh, okay. Did you ever like, get... I work hard for money. I ain't going to send them damn things. I got scammed out $4,500 before. How? The girl was talking to my daughter and talking to me. I figured she was real, so I sent her a bunch of money. You sent her $4,500? All together. From within, within about six months. All together. When was this? About five years ago. Okay. And... Meanwhile, you're no. behind on payments for a $500 rent with I, three I people. Okay. Okay. I was, I was living down over in Bedford somewhere. In the apartments? Yeah. Okay. I lived in the, my best friend lived in the apartments where she lives at. He's one in a wheelchair. That's uh -huh. what I teach. My brother even knows he has. Yeah, yeah, yeah. For sure. Okay, but so. He want to make sure because there's big guys out here and I'm like. <laughs> yeah, for sure. Mm -hmm. So I, I got to ask Paul, I mean, you, you know, obviously you talk about your daughter wanting to get her back and stuff. Yeah. Um, you know, there's obviously... I know it's bad things for doing, talking to her. Well, no, I know. But, like, there's obviously more to address than Emily with that. I mean, it's a bunch of online shit in the first place. Yeah. Like... I'm, I'm getting ready to delete Facebook. But for my, ki my kids being on Facebook, I wouldn't have it. I know. I know. So, right so, now, so I ain't got minutes on my phone. Okay. See, the only time I get... It's my internet here. That's my sister. Okay, let me... I'm sorry if I have to hex my sister real quick. She wanted me to... She's gonna pick my brother up tomorrow morning. My sister is. Okay. She just lives right over here. That's great. Um, so, okay, so Paul, like. Got four in the morning. Okay. So, so when did this online shit kind of start for you with this type of stuff? Just, that's probably about the first one. Uh, no, because we were on the other end of some of the other accounts. I thought they were older girls. You thought they were older? Yeah. Okay. Well, how, how many ended up telling you they were younger? There's two girls. One was 15 down in, in the Madison, Indiana. Madison, Indiana. Okay. Yeah. How, how far is that from here? About two and a half hours drive, I think. Okay. I, she wanted me to come down there and get her and stuff like that, and I, I told her my car broke down on me. Okay. I was, I was living in Bedford at the time. I didn't even go down there. She was in Madison? Okay. Yeah. And what about, the, what about the other one? What other one? I can't remember. I know there's Emily and there's that girl there. I'm trying to think. Yeah, you said there was two, or unless you were talking about Emily, but... but Emily and then there's that one girl down in Madison. Okay. That's the only thing I think of. Most other ones, I've been about 18. Okay. And stuff like that. Like I said, I got, I got girls sending me pictures all the time. Of Can you get the uh, pickles? Sure. Starving. <laughs> and hungry. I got the other bottle of water there. Oh, all right. Oh, sorry. I've been eating. I've been eating Roman noodles. Ro Roman noodles? Yeah. So spaghetti or no, what? Just little noodles like oh, ramen noodles. Yeah, ramen noodles. Oh, okay. That's why I've been eating, trying to lose weight. I lost a little bit since. 
Yeah. All right, cool. Yeah. Oh, I'm tired. I thought I went to bed a little ago. Really? And then she said, you got a package out here? And I'm like, what? Yeah, yeah. I didn't order anything. Golly. All right. So that girl in uh, Madison, Indiana, um, similar shit with Emily, just kind of talking probably yeah. inappropriately. Yeah. This is just a little bit. She, she sent me pictures of her. Oh, shit. Okay. I think. Okay. Yeah, like, what's probably girls wanting to do this type of stuff? A lot of them just wants cards, money. Okay. Does she want cards and money? She asked me to send her a card. Really? And stuff like that. And, but they mostly want me to send them, like, $100 STEM card. STEM, S-T-E-A-M cards. Mm. And, like, Amazon cards. Oh, like that. STEM and, cards? Yeah. They, they go, get stuff online with them, stuff like that. Not like a... I sent the other girl, I gave her all kinds of money. I went to Walmart sending money to her because I thought she was real. She said she was talking. My daughter even talked to her. How old was that girl? She's 27. Okay. But I thought she was real and stuff. And then I come find out she was a star. So we're at. I, I seen her in a movie. I'm like, what the? Do you, get, do you get like any government money at all? Hmm. No. Any of your relatives do in there? My brother's trying to get disability. Okay. So. That's why he's staying with me because he was in an apartment there in Bedford. Oh, ah, okay. And he got kicked out of there because they. He, he's been waiting for 15 months now. And he said, said next thing to the goal is front of a judge. Damn, okay. And so that's coming up pretty soon, I hope. And then he can. It's like yeah. It's like having my place back together. Hopefully the judge rules in, rules in his favor of him taking our tax money for um, not he, working. He, this is all the money he paid in. It's, it's early, like early retirement. Oh, he's like already 60 something? He's or? 58. Okay, that makes sense. So, um. He's got a metal plate here from the bad wreck he was in. He, mm -hmm. he had two head surgery, head, head traumas, but he got the lifeline to Indianapolis. Yeah. And then he's got artificial hip. God damn. He's, he disturbs having money. Okay. I, I'll, I'll probably work till I die, though. Do you have, like, any teeth at all? No, I got busted in, in a bad wreck. Okay, so if he has an artificial hip, you must have had a lot of artificial sweetener. Um, no. I was, no? I was in a bad wreck. I got hit by a semi back in 92. Bad wreck, okay. We were up there, you know, we're 50 and 60 junctions. Yep. Urine. Mm -hmm. We were pulling in my boss's driveway, and the semi hit, slid 150 feet where his still hit, flipped us bum over. I got a little box in my face. Wow. God, do you really talk fast, and I always have stories, huh? It <laughs> hurt. Yeah, yeah. I think instead of like buying used cars, you should probably just start selling them. I mean, honestly, yeah. yeah. I ain't got that. I ain't that good salesperson. I think you would be. I, I think you would be. It. But um, okay. So, so this this girl in Madison, this girl in Madison, Indiana. I mean, she said she. You said she sent her she, she, pictures. I mean, was she sending like? She sent me pictures of her bikini. Of her bikini. Bikini and stuff like that. She wanted me to come down there and pick her up and bring her back down to Bedford with me and stuff like that. And I told her I'll be down there, but I never went. Was she talking about sleeping with you too? She wanted me to come sleep with her. Okay. She said she's already had sex a few times. Okay. And stuff like that, and her boyfriend hit her. So, so, so my guess is you probably participated in that conversation too, the same way with Emily, just kind of saying some shit you shouldn't have said. I was talking to her and stuff like that, and she asked me to come down there and get her. And okay. I told her, yeah, I'll come down there, but I didn't go. But did you also tell her, like, yeah, I'll have sex with you, baby, shit like that? I just talked to her. So, so you were more sexual with the 11-year-old than the 15-year-old? No. I was, I was joking. I, mean, I, was, I know I was talking. Well, well no, 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 no. But I'm, I'm, I'm saying, I'm saying, like, no. I'm saying, I mean, this has been 15 year olds a couple years ago. Okay, but, uh, but, I, so I, she, I, she was sending you messages. Yeah. Did you send some back to her? I said I would like to have. Some stuff. Okay. Okay, that's what I was asking. And stuff like that, and that was it. Okay. But we never said anything and stuff like that. Okay. Did your daughter know about that 15 year old girl? No, none of my kids do. Okay. Got it. So is nobody, your nobody sees my phone but me. Okay. And stuff. Okay. I, good. She said she's gonna block me. I said good. See you. Okay. So I mean, what about Emily? Um, you know, you talk about her. Talk about yeah, I want your sweet, all this type of crap. Like how how at the time how was that like enticing in a way? I'm just asking. Like how was that? I've never been with the person before. And okay. Was that was that? I, I didn't lose my until I was 21. Okay. So you kind of uh, the idea of being with a virgin was kind of was it exciting to you in a way? I was hoping she'd been older. But older but you can't find that right yeah no definitely not nowadays so so, so you were so that, that's what was kind of what the entire the interesting thing was about this yeah okay i know i went over that one day and so that so went to meet her okay so, i don't know what would have happened though but, would you have uh, again left it up to her yeah okay but you know obviously you know putting two to get two together here like she's a and you want to, you, you always want to be with a and like it, it all makes sense now i i understand what you're saying um okay so you said, would you like to play? Yeah, we play, blah, 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 blah. <laughs> okay, so, so, so it wasn't because, okay, so, so it wasn't because she was 11, it was because she was a virgin? Yeah. Okay, got it, so. Because I never, you can't find that name. Right. The only time I ever had is one girl was 
And she was 23, 23 years old until mm -hmm. she was a church girl. Oh. And I was giving her a lot of respect. I didn't want to, I wanted to wait until she got, we got married before we had. Right, right. Cause I didn't, like I said, that was my 21st birthday before I had my, with a married woman. Okay. Wow. Nice. Good shit. So you asked Emily, <laughs> you can move in with me. That's when she turns 18. When she turns 18? Yeah. Okay. So you, you were actually wanting her to move in eventually, just not now? No. I don't want, I now I got this one in here. So dad, okay. she's a good girl. I don't know why I was, I was being stupid talking to her. Okay. I know I was being stupid talking to her. Okay. But I'm glad, glad she blocked me. So I don't have to a little wake-up call for you? Yeah. Okay. This right here is wake-up call. Yeah, call yeah. You so you say here, will you please let me see your tonight? She said they, she said they small, and you said I love small I and and more mouthfuls of waste anyways. I don't like people that have big ass Okay. She's got pretty good size, but she's, she's starting to gain her weight back, so like that's, mm, that's going to get big. She's got two, had two kids, and, but her mom's got them. Okay. She got, she got in luck. She's around wrong people and so like that got on drugs but since, since she's been with me for over a year she's not done anything mm -hmm. i don't allow drugs around because the girl the girl i used to live with she had drugs in the apartment and i got busted for it really i'm 52 years old never did drugs in my life nice okay nice. hey nine cop jeremy bridge is there in bedford he says i know you don't do drugs but i want the first one here so uh, the first cop here is when they did they found there's a little trace of stuff in the in the baggie that's the only thing i got busted for wow and like you take me a drug go drug test me i don't care please take me drug test they wouldn't do it. My probation officer, he heard everything I said to him. Mm -hmm. <laughs> he says, yeah, they should give you a drug test. Okay. So, what what is it about you and asking for just shower pictures from her? Like, yeah, a lot of times you ask, like show me your Is she in a shower? Okay. Yeah, I, like, I like seeing people in showers. I, I go in there and talk to her when she's in a shower. Okay, so that's just kind of a turn on for you in a way? Okay. That's a long time. But yeah. I'm just glad that. I'm getting this stuff out of my head and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. I've been so stressed out. Yeah, it's, I think that's mainly what it is. I'm stressed about money and I'm stressed about all kinds of other stuff. We're about ready to get, if I don't get my rent caught up by the end of this month, we get kicked out of here. So yeah. I, last week I paid a big ass light bill and that's $780. Because I didn't get my light bill for three months here. Oh, okay. And then I finally, when I finally got it, we called and split, had split up three months, 471, 471, 350. Did you, did you ever think like during the course of this conversation, like what the am I doing? Stupid. Okay, got it. I know I was being stupid. All right. I admit to that part, I was being stupid. Okay. So, you, you know, Paul, um, we got to, and I know you never sent your actual to her, no, um, but the, that. right, but the, the, the underwear pictures are obviously you because, you know, I, I can tell you because we can obviously see where the pictures came from. Okay. Like we can click on them, see where it got sent from. And we can also, Oh, I'm I sorry. Got, I got bad back when I, when I had that semi wreck. Mm -hmm. It fucked my back up. Oh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Listen to you. <laughs> I get back spasms every once in a while. That's why I got to sit down sometimes. Yeah, that makes sense. So, I mean. I got lawn chairs all over the yard. So I'm not here, I'm mowing. Like I had that thing going a while ago and then it died on me again. Mm -hmm. I took it to work with one of the guys that looked, looked at it for a little bit, so I'm going to take it to the shop tomorrow. All right. So, right here we have, um, I mean, obviously this is this. You, you, you know, I'm not like a meat watcher, but this is right. But this is the this is the same size right here, and and there's the same cabinet in each photo here. Yeah. And this also came from your thing, because you know. Yeah, I, I can say, you know, I tell people I may have a big one, but I don't. Okay, but so anybody so, lies, lies about it, then they're lying about it and stuff like that. They want to brag about it. Okay, so this is yours right here. Yeah. Okay. So why'd you lie about it at first? Say it wasn't. It, I said it's mine and stuff like that. No, you, you said, said this my, is you said this ain't that big though. I have heard us have a soft in there. You had a sock in here when you yeah. took. You, you took your picture with a sock. I can show you right now. <laughs> Wait. So so you didn't send her a, a small sock in there. Like, that's what try to make it look bigger and that makes the girls happy. Okay, so you didn't send your pick. You sent a sock pick. Yeah. Okay, got it. Yeah. Wow. All right. Um, <laughs> Listen to it. <laughs> all right. I know I got a small. I ain't gonna lie about it. <laughs> you really stuffed your pants with a sock yeah. to impress an eleven-year-old. That that's. That picture gets sent to a couple other people, older women for stuff like that. They asked for my dick picture, and so I just sent them that picture. I had that picture on my phone for a long time. Okay, I'll but that part. but you but you, you you but you sent a picture of stuffed pants to impress an eleven-year-old. I mean, you, 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 you know how weird that kind of like. I know. Okay. Yeah. Wow. Um, <laughs> that's so bizarre. Yeah, I don't know. That's stupid. Yeah. I'm into. I'm, I'm stupid. Okay. 
So I, I mean, now I have a peace of mind though that this wasn't because she was 11. It's just because she was a. Yeah. Okay. So, so you said you were just out to take a, or have a. You weren't out to go have sex with kids, right? Okay. I, thought, I was hoping she was been older than what she was. Right. I was hoping. But, okay. I, I guess I deleted her off there before, and so and all of a sudden she sent. Uh, okay. About a month later, she sent me another thing. Saying, okay. I was crying. Got it. Like got it. Okay. So, so her age wasn't the prize here. It was her virginity, pretty yeah. much. Okay. Okay. So, so that's why I, I wanted. I never been in with any. Okay. I would think twenty one's the youngest I've ever been. Okay. So, so that's why you. Husband, husband younger. So, so you wanted like because she was. A not because you of her age, is that right? Okay, yeah. okay, got it. So, um, what do we do meet? You said kiss, where at, and lips in your sweet pee. And then here you say, if, if you let me. Yeah. Okay, so that would have been her decision too? Yeah. Okay. So, yeah, I, won't, I won't force myself in the Well, I, I appreciate that. Yeah. All right. Um, He's getting hot. <laughs> so yeah, we're getting bitten up by mosquitoes here. I know, that's why, that's why I would. I don't, you know, I, I don't want you to come on to me um, tonight. I ain't gonna come on nobody. Well, I mean, if mosquitoes are biting me, it's gonna look like I have a bunch of small. So I mean, like you know, I just gotta just gotta make sure. All right. All right. Have you ever on a before? You say, "How are you getting out Saturday? Where are you telling your mom you're going?" Um, then you say, "Will you try it with me?" So again, you're asking, just asking her this. Yeah. Okay. We can do it in your bed or mine or my car. Okay. So would it, would basically would that also be her in her court? Well, I never her, had. I never had. Asked. You've never had your piss? No. So you've had sex, but you haven't had your piss. You're not missing out. <laughs> You're not missing out? Nah. Yeah, we, we do it to each other all the time, and oh, it's, yeah. it, it yeah, sucks. <laughs> and I'm just kidding. We know you're lying there. <laughs> Oy vey, well, uh, you see, there's a thing called a, uh, well, that's a whole other conversation, isn't it? I had a friend's piss the other day from this one person. It was like a beautiful woman. Uh -huh. I found out it was a guy. I like, sleep. <laughs> I'm like, no way, Jose. Wait, was it like a Miss Mag or It's some kind of trans thing, what it's called. <laughs> Lady oh. Maga. It had and everything. I mean, it had like this. Was it, was it, was it one of those, uh, was it one of those, love, no, was it, was it one of those shows like Dylan Mulvaney or was it one of those real American women like, yeah, Blair White, yeah. It was, it was one pretty as hell and stuff like that. And, I come find out it's a guy. I'm like, I deleted it. Okay. I'm like, I ain't gay. But you know how you know, you understand how transphobic that could be to the to the to Donald Trump, right? Because Don, Donald Trump says Caitlyn Jenner can go into any bathroom that he or I'm sorry that she wants to. Yeah, Trump is so based, isn't he? Isn't he, Paul? He, he Paul, Trump's a great guy. I, I quit following politics. No, I agree. And Trump, remember. Wait, this government's here anymore. I just don't want. To I agree. Well, did you take the Trump vaccine or did you take the Biden vaccine? I take Biden. You took the Biden vaccine? I got, that COVID shit. Yeah. I got all, I got all four shots. <laughs> I did because work was telling us to do it. Oh, okay. They had a letter saying they were going to make us do it, and I just didn't want to pay no damn fine. They made you take four shots? Yes, I just went ahead and take all four shots because they said you can't get on a plane either because I want to go to Hawaii. Oh. And you got to get on a plane, and you got to have to show me proof of their COVID shit, what they said. You got to be vaccinated to go to Hawaii? I'm going to get on a plane, I think. Mm -mm. I'm going to go out to different countries and shit. You literally gave it. You're literally giving it. <laughs> like, it hurt oh. like hell when they did it. It, well, but, it made me sick a little bit after they gave me the shot. But how are you going to go to Hawaii when you're behind on a $500 rent? That's, that's, that's a long time ago. Oh, okay. One of my good friends in Bowling Alley, he owns a house over there. Oh, in Hawaii? He told me if I ever want to go over there, I got, I got a place to stay. Oh, well, nice. I just pay for the flight. Nice. And I, ain't found him, I ain't seen him for a couple of years. So you, so, you took the, so you took the Biden vaccine, not the Trump vaccine? No. Because okay. work told us to do it. Got it. But they told us not, we get laid off. And I'm like, oh. I went to Walmart real quick and got it done for free. Absolutely, absolutely. I ain't losing my job. Yeah. Damn, I just wish you would have taken the I'm Trump vaccine. Facebook tonight. Got it. So, um... The only thing is, I talked to my daughter and stuff like that on there. That's the only bad thing about it. I just deleted mm -hmm. about 90% of people off my friends list. It says I got 350-some people on there. My list only got about 20 people on it. Yeah. Why is your list a lot of, like, younger, younger than 18? I don't even know how old they are. Okay. That's good. My best friend, Brady, he ain't got a Facebook no more because he got in trouble one night at racetrack. Cause some girl came and seen him and his wife showed up at the same time. Oh, shit. So he, he ain't got a Facebook, but yeah. him, his wife, and all of them down in Florida are heading back up here. Do the pickles deliver here? Yeah. Okay. Dude, I was going to say, um, what was I going to say? I don't know how long this is going to be because I'm about to go to bed pretty soon. No, that's facts, dude. Um, what was I going to say? Um, oh, if you want pizza and stuff like that, they won't deliver out here. Right. Did, you, did, your, did, your, did your wife, like, why, why does she have the kids? My ex-wife. Yeah. 
when we were down in Kentucky, we split up. She ain't got none of the kids either. Her, mm -hmm. my, my daughter, she's 20. She lives with her boyfriend. My son's in there in the bedroom playing his Xbox like he always does. <laughs> uh, I try to get him to come out here and help in the yard and stuff like that, but Xbox is more important than anything. Right. Then my youngest daughter, she lives down there in Tennessee with her aunt. Did, did anybody like ever try to accuse you of doing something no. in person? No. No? They've never like accused you? Yeah, like when we split up, I, I didn't have nowhere to be at down there, and my kids were yeah. also down there, and so I walked back up here from Kentucky. Okay, but so I'm saying, that, I'm saying, did, did I had nowhere to live up here? Did, so I, I mean, did your ex like ever accuse you of anything with the daughters at all? No. No. Okay. No. So my daughters, poor brats, they got whatever they, they got. I cooked for them every night, and the only thing I didn't do is she had to give them baths. So I wouldn't not give them baths. Got it. And I even my son, I wouldn't give him baths. Got it. But I come, I work all day long, come home and cook, and, and her mom got this at her for it. Mm -hmm. I was cooking and cleaning and stuff like that while she sits her ass on the couch. Okay. And her mom jumped her ass for it. And she got mad and she took off, took, went to Louisville with some guy. Right. And then I was down there with my kids and it's all her family and I didn't have nowhere to stay. Got it. So, I so, come back up here. So you said this 15 year old in Madison was two years ago? Yeah. Okay. I believe so. Okay. Yeah, cause I was living in Ted Jones Drive at that time. Yeah. So in, so in this, uh, so in the span of two years, I mean, how, how many other accounts have like hit you up saying like, hey, I'm younger, hey, I'm younger, like. I don't know. There's a lot of times I can't remember shit sometimes. Right, but if you if you can remember, because obviously the stuff the stuff said to Emily was pretty like, you know, it's pretty, it was, it was a lot for just, you know, a quote unquote first or second time. Yeah, I started talking to her and stuff like that. Yeah, but, I, but I'm, I'm, I'm. I was like having friends. Right, but I'm, but I'm saying like, have any, have any, have you had friends online that have just been younger? No. Just that 15 year old and her. Okay. The rest of them went over 18. Okay. Has, has there been anybody online like, I mean, do you watch? Not very much. Not very much. When you, like, how often? When I was living alone, I watched it a lot. Okay. What, what, what was you like? What did you typically watch? What did you watch? A bee. Yeah. <laughs> That's just a certain. Doesn't matter. Okay. So like that. I mean, did you think any of the you watched maybe caused some of this to be said? Probably. Okay. Was any of the like probably too young to to look at? No, everyone's over eighteen. And Everyone was over eighteen. Yeah. Was there like even one or two times where they sent you something under eighteen? No, I wasn't. I didn't look at it. Cause everything, I was all my stuff free, free, right? Eighteen and plus. Right. No, no. I'm not saying if you looked at it, but has anybody ever sent that to you before? No. No. Okay. Yeah, I mean, this definitely isn't like a... I'm kind of glad she deleted me. Cause... Yeah, this, is, this isn't a good thing. No. I mean, what, what do you think? I mean, what do you think What do you think wifey's going to say? Or fiance, sorry. It's my girlfriend. Yeah. How did y'all meet each other? We talked before, and then last year I saw her walking. I gave her a ride and, and stuff like that, and then we've been together since. Really? I just started talking to her. I've been talking to her for a little bit and stuff like that, Emily, but... I wish I never did stop start talking to her. Mm -hmm. Well, we got to, I mean, I think we should probably tell her, like, just kind of give her, fill, fill her in on what's kind of happening here. Just, you know, I'm not going to try to f you, but um, yeah. I think just tell her, like, hey, could this kind of happen? You should probably work on this in the relationship. You know what I mean? And she, sit, she was on the couch, or sitting in a chair next to me, and I talked to Emily before, but she didn't, she don't look at my phone. All right, well, let's. That's the one thing, we don't look at each other's phones. All right, well, just so there's some honesty going on, we should, yeah. let's, let's, you mind bringing her out here? Yeah. All right. Paul kind of got himself in a situation here um, where there is an 11 year old girl that he was messaging online and he tried to go over a couple weeks ago to have sex with her. And um, then tonight he was uh, talking about doing it, but I didn't go anywhere. he didn't go tonight, but he asked, was asking for photos from her and all that type of stuff. And um, you know, this has been going on for a little bit. I mean, he was asking for lots of of this girl and all this shit, but yeah, I mean, you know, obviously you guys have to sort out your own issues, but I think that, um, we'll sit down and talk about it. Yeah, but, but I think that, you know, especially because the girl's 11 years old and stuff like that, I think it's just a, way too young to even be, you know, in a gray area with, you know what I mean? I, I, we don't talk to each other on Facebook no more. We blocked each other. Yeah, but this was like 30 minutes ago. It was longer than 30 minutes. You've been here for over 30. Okay. Well, like an hour ago. I mean, it was, it was tonight, you know yeah. what I mean? And, Basically, the whole the whole week he was this past week he was saying you're ready for your to be, to be taken blah 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 to to this girl, and um, 
yeah, it's just not a good situation at all. And I think, you know. They're waking me up to come out here talking to me. Right. And I think for, for full, full on honesty, I think, you know, you should know about this. And you know, she even knows I've been stressed out lately too, ain't it? Yeah. So, um, this was all on Facebook, so I don't know what y'all want to deal with I'm, with that, but. If she wants me to delete Facebook, I'll delete Facebook. Do you? That's up to you. Yeah, just definitely not a good, because it's one thing to be unfaithful, but it's also another thing to be unfaithful with, I don't know, a fifth grader. Well, I guess going into sixth grade now, it is summer after all, but um, a fifth grader. So. What, buddy? He's been getting beat up by other cats. I know. He's a straight cat around here. Maybe he is a stray cat. Yeah. Well, he's friendly as hell, though. <laughs> so you invited a fictional small pussy over to stay with you, but not a real small. Pussy. Okay, that's how it works. All right. Well, he's really adorable. Did you give him a name yet? That's gone great. Yeah. Can't call him Smokey because we already got a cat named Smokey. Name Smokey. Yeah, she's a cute little shit. Oh. Got it. Well, I mean, yeah, I just thought you should probably know about this. We'll, we'll never sit down and talk about it. Absolutely. Absolutely. I'm going to do but delete. I deleted a bunch of people off there while I go and stuff like that because I don't want nothing if I'm done with it. I heard on Facebook while we're at work. Hmm. So I, can't, I ain't done it for two weeks because the only time I get on Facebook is when I'm at home. Right. Because I get the internet here. Yeah, and he waited like over an hour one Saturday. I guess when he's alone on Saturday or something like that, he waited an hour alone just to kind of for to come out of the apartments. So um, I think it's just kind of something that, and I, I guess he stuffs his, uh, puts his sock in his pants sometimes and sends That's it out to people. Anyway. It's an old picture. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, if it, me up when you guys yeah, like if it's not a sock, then I would say you're a lucky lady. But if he's <laughs> what he's saying, it is it is a sock. Um, yeah, I'm really. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I'm really, really sorry that happened. Um, you ever like take the lawnmowers to? Like to sell them? No, work on. To to work on? I mean, you can start in your own lawn here, but no. I just wanted to mow get my lower space so I can mow my grass. Ah. Oh. Last time I did, I used to be here on. So now you want to something other than an eleven-year-old hat? Well, that's funny. Um, okay, so with these, I don't know. Work like, I mean, they if you stay running, that's what I was wondering. Okay, I mean, someone, someone knows what the hell they're doing on stuff. I mean, do you I'm maybe you should probably make some billboards and just advertise. No, I'm just gonna, there's a place in the league. I think she said like, she looked it up. Okay. I mean, did you like? Did you end up fixing these yourself, the or the middle one was given to you? I bought that. It does. When you pull on that string, there's yeah. little fingers in there. They broke off on it. Got it. And this one here, me and her, she bought it at the flea market two weeks ago. Yeah. And then we started it. Started right up and said, start mowing, it dies. I mean, the guy at work, he looked at it today and stuff like that. It worked a little bit and I just, then I got it going again and that's all we mowed. She was going to mow a little bit she liked doing exercise. Maybe you can put a sock in it to get it working. I don't know. But yeah, I just thought you should probably probably know about what's what's going on because, you know, obviously if there's a, you know, shit that f***ing happens between the two of you. Oh, what the f***? Who in the shit called? Jesus Christ. Did you call the cops? No. no I guess you didn't. Okay. You did. I probably didn't. No, I didn't call shit. I mean, I was here the whole time. So we should just be honest about it. We'll figure it out. How's it going? There's there's kind of a situation here. Um, Paul, Paul was just talking to somebody. Yeah, I was talking to somebody. I was probably a little bit too young, right? Yeah. You know, like 11, young. Okay. And 
Did you? We delete each other, block each other. Delete. Okay. So. But you unfortunately went over there to have sex, which you shouldn't have done, right? Yeah. Okay. I, we didn't do. We didn't meet or nothing like that. All right, but but you tried to. And that's the problem, right? Okay. So, yeah. So the, that's that's the situation pretty much. And you sent a. Uh, stuffed underwear pictures to her as well and it, okay and you asked that's, that's an old picture. okay and you asked for of her too which yeah, i don't know why i did that okay so i mean you said this was the youngest girl you talked to yeah. okay so do you have the text message yes we do we do um he went to go meet her in the city i guess not the county but um obviously it's all the same county here Handcuffs. I'm not going to run anything. Can I hear you? Put your arm is hurt. I got on. What's the thing? I wasn't going to look at the phone. Yep. Oh, and sir, he also, uh, she also has his phone. He gave it to her. Oh, keep these. So these aren't everything, but you'll get a very clear picture of like what's going on here by reading these. Like I'm 11, and then on camera voluntarily, he like he said, yeah, I was gonna do all that stuff. Like he didn't hide anything really. Now you you didn't ask for any pictures. Nah. No. Nah. Yeah, he and yeah, you see, he said in the first one. Yeah, we asked him for a selfie, like a face shot or whatever, but like all the like he solicited the whole time. Well, we didn't send him any, but you know, you know what I mean. Yeah. All right. And we have all the copies like digitally for you guys where it's more than that, but that's like, should be more than enough to just see like, okay. And we're from Houston, Texas. So um, he tried to meet up a few weeks ago when we weren't obviously not in town. So we had him take a picture of him actually going to meet so we could prove that he did, did go in fact to meet and all that stuff. Pump. 